voiceover. Welcome, fellow food enthusiasts, to another episode on culinary recipe creations. Today, we're embarking on a mouth-watering journey to create a scrumptious triple berry pie with a buttery crust and vanilla whipped cream. Before we dive in, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and ring the bell to get updates on our latest culinary adventures. If you enjoy our videos, please give us a thumbs up and share the joy of cooking with your friends and family. We always welcome your thoughts and ideas, so don't hesitate to leave a comment below. Now let's roll up our sleeves, tie on our aprons, and prepare to craft a dessert that's sure to win the heart of any pie lover. Our first step, crafting the perfect buttery crust. Stay tuned, A. Eh? Imagine the perfect blend of sweet berries, buttery crust, and creamy vanilla whipped cream. Envision sinking your teeth into a slice of pie that's a symphony of flavors, a celebration of textures. This is the triple berry pie with a buttery crust and vanilla whipped cream, a dessert that's as delightful to make as it is to devour. Begin by crafting the foundation of the pie, the buttery crust. In a food processor, blend together flour, sugar, and salt. Then, add cold cubed butter, pulsing until the mixture forms coarse crumbs. Here's a helpful tip. The butter must be cold to ensure a flaky crust. As you gradually add ice water, watch as the dough comes together. Divide it into two discs, wrap in plastic wrap, and let it chill in the refrigerator for an hour. Once the dough is chilled, it's time to roll out the pie crust. Remember, practice makes perfect. Don't worry if it's not flawless on the first try. Preheat the oven to 375 degrees Fahrenheit, roll out one disc of dough to fit a 9-inch pie dish, and trim any excess. Now, the star of the show, the triple berry filling. In a large bowl, combine hulled and have strawberries, blueberries, and raspberries. Sprinkle in granulated sugar, cornstarch, fresh lemon juice, and zest. Toss gently to combine, preserving the integrity of these lovely berries. Pour this vibrant medley of berries into the prepared pie crust. Roll out the second disc of dough and create a lattice pattern atop the berry filling. This adds a charming rustic touch and allows steam to escape during baking. Place the pie in the preheated oven and bake for 45 to 50 minutes. Watch as the crust turns golden brown and the berry filling bubbles with delight. While the pie is baking, it's time to prepare the final touch. Vanilla Whipped Cream In a chilled bowl, whip together heavy cream, powdered sugar, and vanilla extract until stiff peaks form. This homemade whipped cream is a cool, creamy contrast to the warm, fruity pie. Allow the pie to cool for at least two hours before serving. Patience is a virtue, especially when it comes to pie. As you slice into this masterpiece, serve each piece with a generous dollop of vanilla whipped cream. This triple berry pie with buttery crust and vanilla whipped cream is truly a delight for the senses. The combination of fresh berries, buttery crust, and creamy vanilla whipped cream creates a flavor extravaganza that's perfect for any special occasion or just to satisfy your sweet cravings. So roll up those sleeves and dive into the delightful process of pie making. Share your creations and relish in the joy of homemade dessert. Bon appétit! As we wrap up our delicious journey of creating the perfect triple berry pie, we hope you've enjoyed the process as much as we did. Remember, cooking is an art and you're the artist. Don't be afraid to experiment and put your own spin on this recipe. This is Culinary Recipe Creations, your one-stop channel for all your culinary adventures. If you enjoyed this tutorial and found it helpful, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss our future delicious escapades. We'd love to hear from you, so leave a comment below and tell us how your triple berry pie turned out or if there are any other recipes you'd like us to explore. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and share it with your fellow food enthusiasts. Remember, the joy of cooking is sharing the love through food. Until next time, keep cooking, keep creating, and most importantly, keep eating.